Peace, peace. What's good, fam? Coming to you live from near the West Side Highway in Manhattan. Um, just want to say a few things about, um, I guess, Kanye, 50 Cent, and Ice Cube. I guess my thing about that is I feel like out of those three, the only person that really has his heart in the right place is Ice Cube. The only problem I have with Ice Cube is that it's really folly to think that they're going to act, up, that anybody, especially Trump, is going to act upon their plan. Uh, Joe Biden has a plan called Lift Every Voice that came out, if not months, at least weeks before uh, Trump's platinum plan. And I think that with uh, Biden, at least we'll have some people in the room or we'll be close enough to the table to kick the legs off if our agenda isn't met. And I looked at Biden's plan, I looked at Trump's plan, I looked at Ice Cube's plan. The only thing that really seems feasible is Biden's plan and constitutional. So I don't want to disparage Ice Cube just yet, but for 50 Cent and Kanye, I just feel between the psychosis of, of Kanye and the mental health issues and the selfishness of 50 Cent, who was never really a voice for us anyway. I know you guys like power and all that stuff, but uh, he was never really, he always seemed kind of like a, a po not a positive force in our community. I know that he has a show, I know that he hires people, I know that he has a, uh, gives people opportunities, I know that he has this uh, show about the lawyer, the, the lawyer that came out and helped a lot of black people in, in prison that was in prison wrong, but you know, and I know that there's going to be some people that disagree with me. But uh, if there's a cancel, I guess I definitely, I've already canceled Kanye and 50 Cent. Um, and I just feel like we got to be smart. We got to be tactical. And we got to realize that it's not just about electing somebody. It's about the resistance and the things that we fight for and the agenda that we fight for after they get into office. Trump is already a proven white supremacist, white nationalist. And if you don't agree with that, you want to argue with me about that, that's cool. Um, if you get disrespectful, you will be blocked. I want to say that much. Uh, because I'm trying to move forward, trying to move forward for people of African descent and for all people that want justice. That's what this page is going to be about, this channel is going to be about. So please, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, you can hit the notification if you want. You know, uh, I don't post a lot. I don't post like every five minutes or something like that, stuff like that. But I do ask that you do subscribe, tell friends. I only got, I think I only have like 63 uh, friends, subscribers. But I have like over 20,000 followers or whatever, likes on Facebook. And then I have, you know, almost over 12,000 followers on uh, like my regular personal pages. And then I got like 2,000 plus on my on my Instagram, and I got like over 200 on Twitter. So I should definitely have more uh, followers here. I'm really just getting into it, but uh, again, please subscribe. Uh, please hit notifications and tell your friends, and uh, I hope you guys have a good night. Those are my thoughts on uh, Kanye, 50 Cent, and Ice Cube, and I just feel that if or when Biden win, wins, we have to keep up the pressure. We have to keep fighting for the things that we want. But I think one of the first things we have to do is this whole thing with the coronavirus. Anyway, I've spoken way too long. Um, I'll highlight you guys later. I hope you guys are having a blessed night. And um, I'll talk to you soon. Peace.